Nate and I took today to catch up on some rest, but don't worry, we didn't sit around the whole day. In fact, we held one interview with a group of German soldiers that said exactly what was on their mind. Day 19 starts right now. Now, do you have a family back home? No. Um, uh, yes, no, of, of, of course, I have a mom and a dad and a brother, but no girlfriend or wife. And what, do your, what does your family think about you serving in Afghanistan? Yeah, they, it's okay. They have... Nice again. They think it's a good idea yeah. because um, I'm in the military for 12 years now and um, they live with that and um, yeah, that's okay. That is my, my first time in, in Afghanistan and I was, uh, before I was in, in, in Kosovo, so um, yeah, it's good. And is your family proud of what you're doing here? Oh, my family um, is not so proud. Um, that I'm here. Um, it's the second time and um, the first time they said it's okay that I'm staying here yeah. and um, now um, I um, have the order to go here to Afghanistan and um, I talked to my family and they say um, okay but um, they are very um, angstig. Afraid? <laughs> they are very afraid um, at home and um, they um, wait for me to that I um, will be back in Germany. Um, so what would you like the people of Germany to know about your role mm -hmm. here? <sighs> the role of the German armed force you mean, not my, uh, my no, role. No, how you feel, you know, like what would you want people in Germany to know about what you're doing here? I know, you know, I don't... I... M myself. Yeah, you. Yeah. you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, so my my order here is to be uh, the reserve for the guys who are fighting outside. So that's the point why we are in the quick reaction forces. And um, from this point of view, I'd say I have to be here because um, the guys from the German armed forces who are outside and helping the yeah, civilians <laughs> are under the security of our QRF in, at least and that's the point I say I'm here because um, I'm trying to help to get the guys who are outside and talk and uh, work with the civilians have to be secure mm -hmm. so that's the point um, that's my job <laughs> and, and how important do you say that job is Oh, I'd say it's really important because if you look in the newspapers and the media and all that stuff um, you see some so many problems with IEDs and something like that and small arms fires against um, the guys who are outside and I'd say it's a really yeah, good job for me because um, if I have nothing to do so I know nobody is injured, nobody has any problems outside. So that's, that's the thing I'd say is my opinion from my work here and that's the point I want to let the Germans know. That's good. Yeah. Do you have anything here? Are you glad to be here? Uh, <laughs> Glad is a good. <laughs> yeah, I'd I'd use a different word because um, word I'm I'm ordered to be here, so it's um, to to uh, make a description why it's that so, because um, from the unit I come I come from, there are nine guys who are who have the same. Um, let's say, say some more uh, yeah, do that do the same job as as me and eight places have to be fulfilled here in Afghanistan from that guys from from my um, base so um, it was at least an order to be here and to be glad about an order something um, very uh, special I'd say because you have some some yeah own feelings uh, own opinion about um, all that stuff and um, glad is I'd say the wrong word um, I'd say it's interesting to be here. I'm not happy about, but uh, it's my job, so it's okay. I've signed there for that from for several years, and uh, yeah, it's my job. You know, what are some things that you guys are doing here that you think is making a difference for the Afghans outside of the gate? Um, 
Yes, um, we are uh, standing so long here in Afghanistan and um, more than seven or eight years and um, the cure is um, a little bit better now, okay, but um, we have um, much to do that the, um, the cure, the cure um, will be very good and the people can uh, live um, in freedom here. Yes. What's your hope for the Afghan people? My hope? So, um, my hope is a bit different from the German hope itself, I'd say, because um, or from from the Western countries hope. So because um, they have the hope to bring democracy, democracy to here. And that's not my hope. My hope is to um, have the Afghan people to be secure in their own country and to have some reign they can live with, I'd say. Because it's, yeah, that's the point. To be secure in your own country and can do what you want to do in your country. So that's the point, I'd say. And do you think that we're helping them get there? Yeah, in, in, a, in a way, uh, of course, I'd say, yeah, because um, the yeah, anti-Afghan fighters, as they call here, um, I'd say a bit hard to, to work with if you want to have this. So you, um, yeah, you have to fight against these guys um, or to um, yeah, change their minds, and that's a hard thing, I'd say. Yeah. So I hope they feel secure one time, the Afghan guys. And that would be the best way to end this. Now, when you go out the gates, do you do you feel pretty safe when you go out the gates here in Mazar Sharif? Yes, uh, when I go out to, uh, in the area of Mazar Sharif, I feel safe because um, the population here is uh, is friendly, and um, our our combat vehicles are safe. And um, yes, so. It's good for me to go out, and when we drive to Baglan or Kunduz, it's the same, because the, the most of the people are friendly, and um, there are some insurgents who don't like us. So um, yes, we defend us, and um, it's okay. I have to admit. There were times in the interview I felt uncomfortable. I wear a uniform and am part of the ISAF team just as they are. There is a part of me that never wants to hear that people are unhappy or that they don't feel they are making a difference. But that's what makes this project so special. We're out here to get the truth, however it's presented. It's not always positive, but it's definitely not always negative. Somewhere between the lines lives the truth, and that's what we're here to get. Join us tomorrow as we continue 30 days through Afghanistan.